How's it? IndianCowboy.Sports.com Coming at you on Saturday as we get this video to you around this time. As you guys know, I am a semi-pro tennis player. Uh, you know, I was a former, was a former champ uh, in high school, etc. And then, uh, yeah, moved on to, to college and played some tennis there as well. So, uh, yeah, so still keeping up with it. And, uh, you know, occasionally on these tournaments, on these circuits and stuff. Nothing, nothing pro or anything like that. It was... Pro level player tennis players. I can't tell you how good pro level tennis players are, but yeah, semi pro tennis is a lot of fun. Win some tournaments every now and then, as you can tell. And um, you know, it's uh, I'm, I'm not the best semi pro tennis player, but I uh, play a lot of doubles and um, still make it. You know, in quarterfinals and, and semis and things like that. So you know, it's kind of tough. I don't win a lot actually, but um, meaning championships, but uh, definitely uh, still competitive, which is which is fun. So, yeah, so that's a lot of fun and uh, excited about uh, your card today. Maybe on Twitter I'll post up some serves and um, some different stuff that we're working on and stuff. And, uh, yeah, it's just something to do to stay healthy and active. So nice free pick winner yesterday as we gave you the Bulls plus the points against the Celtics. And uh, that was on the heels of the Bulls over the day before. So back-to-back -back free pick winners for you. I think if I'm not mistaken, we're on a 7-3 and three run over here um, as it relates to as it relates to uh, free picks and stuff. So uh, we are looking into doing some additional stuff down the road. Uh, so just keep an eye out for that uh, as far as content wise. But uh, you know, always be sure to check this video every day. Be sure to like it and subscribe to it if you get a chance. And uh, if anybody else asks you where we are, just tell them we're over at Doc Sports and uh, we moved over here. And in that way, uh, on one channel, you're able to get uh, quite a lot of content, which is our goal here is to provide you good content here in Doc Sports. So um, nice free pick winner again with the Bulls. Uh, how did that New Orleans, uh, uh, we gave you the, we leaned on the under in that game and that did go under as well. So a really good video yesterday. We gave you a free play on the Bulls and then a lean on the under. I like giving you two thoughts, honestly, because I don't have to go so fast and talk so fast and all that stuff. Um, so I enjoyed that portion of it. So um, what do I need to tell you? We had the Astros yesterday in baseball for our premium selections. By the way, our, our best picks are over at Doc Sports, our premium selections. And um, and obviously our next best play is our free pick and our next best play is the lean. Eventually down the road when we do YouTube premium, our best picks will be at Doc Sports, uh, the premium pick. The next best play is the YouTube premium play. Then it's the free play and then it's the extra lean. But of course, it's just a way for you to just get extra content. It'll be a teaching channel where we're really going in depth in one game specifically and kind of try to teach you. And uh, we'll look to doing that in the future as well. We're still working on some logistics with that. But as it relates to this game, uh, I want to talk to you about two games. One is the Pistons. Well, I need to tell you the rest of it. So yeah, we were able to win in baseball. Um, in Korean baseball, we missed our play. On uh, soccer, we're looking to mainly focus on more sides here and trying to get on a run here. And uh, at NBA, we missed our play yesterday too. The Spur or the, uh, the the Nuggets just could not hold on at the end. But uh, hopefully we'll be able to win today. Uh, hockey, uh, we missed on Minnesota as well. Uh, but keep in mind, long-term run though, we're plus 8,500 on the hockey season so far. Um, you know, I think we can go, I think we've won five of six NBA playoffs as well. Hockey's on a 20 and seven run. We're 65 and 38 for the season now, 67% for plus 8,350. Korean baseball, we're sitting at a 13-5 and five run. Baseball, uh, four straight winning years. Astros yesterday, soccer, 8-5 and five run. We had Chelsea at advance, a 7 unit winner recently. So we're excited about all of that, okay? But yeah, as it relates to uh, this selection here, um, I like the... Uh, we're going to go with... Let me double check here. But I believe we're going to go... Yeah, I believe we're going to go with the Grizzlies here today. Minus the five and a half points. I think they're going to be really mad coming into this game. You can find them at about minus five and a half. They lost to the Pistons, ninety-seven to one eleven, as a nine-point favorite. You can't do that when you're trying to get into the playoffs, um, especially the ten seed or the nine seed, which is where they're at. And the Spurs, of course, are at the Blazers tonight. They, uh, you know, played well against Minnesota, beat them one thirty-nine and one thirty-five. Lost to the Knicks and lost to Orlando. Um, then they beat Orlando, but then they, you know, lost to Portland by 21. They just have not been playing well. But I will tell you this, that they are favored by five and a half. And I think that means something here. And you have a Toronto team that lost by five to the Clippers and just lost a brutal heartbreaker to the to the Wizards by two in overtime. 
And obviously with that loss, it kind of eliminates them from the playoff contention, whereas the Grizzlies have to win this game or they're pretty much done. And I think when you put that into consideration, I think Memphis minus the five and a half is certainly worth it here, especially coming off losing to the worst team in the Eastern Conference, Detroit. Now, having said that, so your free pick is on uh, Memphis minus the five and a half. Your extra lean is on the Pistons. I think the Pistons are really undervalued right now. You can find them at about plus ten and a half. Uh, and I think, look, the Pistons are not going to the NBA playoffs. So for them, this is everything. This is their Super Bowl. This is their excitement. And I think they get up here, which is why I thought Chicago was going to get up to face the Celtics and beat them outright. Detroit beat this team by 15 points earlier this year. Detroit also lost to them by four points earlier this year. They covered the eight and a half. They covered the five points. They've covered both times against Philadelphia. They just beat Memphis. They have not tanked at all. They beat them by 14. And uh, I'm sorry, they beat them by, by, yeah, 14 points. And they covered against Charlotte as well in a game that Charlotte had to win. And I think this team, this team also beat Atlanta during this stretch as well. I think this team will get up for this team and play really hard. And you have Philadelphia coming off a two-point win over New Orleans. I did route Houston. Um, but, you know, I think the Pistons can hang tough. And I think they'll get up to play Philadelphia. And this game will mean something to them. So your free play is going to be on Memphis minus the five and a half. And your lean is on Detroit plus the points here as we always try to give you a free play and an extra little lean as well today hope you guys enjoyed the content please take a moment to like and subscribe to the youtube video we have some exciting uh, over at doc sports on the premium side uh, we have a good selection three unit nba today important uh, four unit baseball i believe and then uh, wnba of course is what we're really excited about just six days away we've won four straight years in the wnba as well and uh, we're pretty stoked about it we're looking to maybe doing canadian football not sure if it comes back up. But basically, three units between the Nuggets and the Jazz tonight, three units between the Blue Jays and the Astros. Remember, when you win a three unit play, it's very important because you're avoiding losing a 3.3 unit play. So, really, a three unit play is a plus 6.3 gain because it's better than losing minus 3.3. So, baseball, NBA, uh, Preakness packages are now posted. Uh, we're, we were the site leader in horses last year. Hockey, soccer, WNBA, boxing, and Korean baseball. Lots of exciting stuff. Hope you enjoyed the content today. We'll see you back here tomorrow. Indian Cowboy, working hard for you every single day. Please take a moment to like and subscribe. And hopefully we'll hit your third straight and uh, try to get on an 8-3 and three, uh, free pick run for you here. See you back here tomorrow.